Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are back in Station Ears. Yes, I got it right this time. I called it Icarus last time. That's my other series. Apologies about that. So, where we left off last time, um, we built our um, tool manufactory, and we upgraded our electronics printer to a uh, version 2. You can see the difference. You don't have the levers down the bottom, the buttons on big chunky buttons like this, uh, it's more on display and it allows you access to additional items. So what do I want to build next? I want to see if I can get my advanced furnace kit, what do I need? I need gold, copper and silicon and I believe we have all of those items available. So turn that on. Gold, copper. Oop, wrong one. Gold, copper. And silicon. Am I going mad? Have I just not put gold and copper in there? Okay, I could have sworn I just put gold and copper in there. Gold, copper. Gold, copper. Not enough copper. What's in here? Iron and gold. So I need some copper. Okay, well, can't do anything without the copper, so I better quickly go and mine some copper. Throw copper in there quickly. Okay, where's it? It all seems to put it the most inappropriate place. There we go, it's that done. What else have we got? We have got open that. Clear that. Yeah, potatoes still growing. I know it's only one potato at the moment. I will um, create some proper hydroponics bays and make one. It's got a copper out here. And put it in here. Right. Let's print our advanced furnace. That's going to take a little bit of time to print. So, still no storm coming. I don't think I've got anything left in any of these, do I? I just need to turn them off. Power's okay. It's okay, that's okay. Right, so where would I want to put a light? Probably about here. What I also need to do is change this wiring around slightly. So that cable comes up there. Like so. Might help. Reason being, I want to take this.
and put it here. Have uh, any pipes out here? I do. There we go. And pipes, I can do that. I'm going to need that most of that cabling for the advanced furnace, but I can take up, pick up some of it. Do I move that down there? Don't we need that much? Oops, wrong way. Where we go? That way. So now what I can do is, when I close this door, I can bend the atmosphere that way. Then go in here. And I'm not bringing in any of the pollutants and things from outside. How is the atmosphere in here doing anyway? So we do have a little bit of pollution. We've still got plenty of CO2 in here. That battery's probably probably long dead. Swap it out with one of these for now. And that will take care of the pollution. Yeah, go the pollution's going down now. So yeah, so I can do that. I can set an airlock up in here. Proper airlocks will have as a button to press and it will do all the switching of the doors and things for me. Um, I need to change these two doors to do that. I need a IC housing, a programmable chip, a laptop to program the chip, a button and, and a red light or a LED, which is a console you can do from one of these. So. You can use one of these. So I would look for, oh no, it's an LED lamp I want. I apologize. It's an LED lamp. <laughs> Has pollution gone out here? Yeah, so let's just turn that off, save that battery. What I also want to do is push this out, probably a couple of squares to make that room just a bit bigger, because at the minute it's a bit tight. Are we still printing? Okay, so where did my furnace go? Am I going mad? I know what happened. Damn. Um, because I cut some of the cabling in here, I killed power to the printer. Oh. So frustrating. Um, I need to set that going again. Mm -hmm. Well, after doing that, I may as well go and do a bit of... Um, Mining, just make sure I don't print any more. Why am I printing? No, 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 stop, 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 stop. I want. Advanced furnace. There we go. God, my head's not screwed on today. Right, let's see what we can find. How am I doing on my well, water? is a little bit low. So just mind a few little bits while our printer's going. I need to go and take a drink. Um, I could do with making some more steel as well, so I probably just need to go and find some more iron and coal. And if we can do that while the 
furnace is still hot? Probably is not. Okay, so let's just dump the gold, dump the cobalt. I don't put too much cobalt on me for that one. There we go. And dump the copper and the silicon. Laces can go in my backpack. Right, let's go drink. How are we doing? Oh, you're done now. Good. Oh, I forgot to use my vent. <laughs> I'll set up a vent and not use it. Okay. Oxygen low. Quickly eat and drink. Close lock. Turn that off. How are we doing? Growing towards fruiting. That's the main thing. Let's get rid of the vent the air back into the room. Right, our advanced print air. Uh, furnace so it means I can take this apart so what I'm going to do is I'm going to vent this no, I'm going to need that I'm going to need that I'm going to need that probably don't need the glass or the plastic I will need a Electronics parts, which I need iron for. And I'm going to need iron on me. I need any the printers. No, no, no. I'm in there. That'll do for now. Stick it all in there. So it's all in one place. that. What are we at? Two megapascals. Okay, so let's start. I think it's our oh, angle grinder. That is that. So I stole the battery for something else. Sheets, now the wrench. Or well, the crowbar, crowbar. No oh, crowbar again, okay. And you can go in there, don't need you anymore. So let's just put this somewhere. Furnace kit, there we go. Let's just dismantle all of this. No, oh, let's stick that in there, I pick that up. So, advanced furnace. I'm going to need is somewhere for a tank as well, so I need to print. I'm going to put the. Oh, to make sure I've got the right height. Put that there. One electronics parts. Required a steel sheet. I have any steel sheets ready. I'm sure, I put one somewhere. Oh, oh I need five. <laughs> Where's the steel? Bet's all in here. Everything's in here. Yeah, just make sure there's no storm coming before I unload this. Right, I'm 
let's deal in there. Everything else can pretty much go back in here for now. Include my alloys. Steel sheets. I built a few because I need to build some space for a tank, and I'm going to have to use do, 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 the pipe bend to create some tanks. So push up one, two, three, four, plus the five, and even that's nine. Our advanced furnace, so obviously, I need to add some more bits to it yet. I want to steel frames, create four of these. Initially I'm just going to work this off a tank and um, I will create a more advanced automated furnace later but for now I just want to get it up and running with a tank. So what you do is you, this furnace has pumps, input and output pumps and you can pump the gas back and forth to the tank and insulate the tank rather than to vent the gas all the time and waste it. It does cool down eventually, obviously, but it's better than the basic furnace. Right, next I need... Oh, it's looking... Pipe bender there. Iron in there. Copper and steel. That's copper. Move it there. And there's the steel. Insulate tank. That's what I want. Are you venting occasionally? Come on, hurry up. How's that bottle doing? Yep, yeah, some pressure. And now I want to insulate the pipes. Tank can just go there. How many do we need? One, two, three, four, five, six, about eight. That steel's nearly gone. Have I made? Let's see if we can get over seven for now. So 
what you do is you connect the input and the output oh we need six Cabling, yeah, we need a little bit of cabling as well. Okay, check that. So we need the copper. Cables, should be very quick in this one. pretty much the most basic setup you need for an advanced furnace. Um, what you do is, let's see, we go ten of those. Which would happen there, it should have taken us ten odd. Oh, what about the cable in that why? Oh thank goodness for that because we put that in there at the wrong time. You lose it. Because it melts. Right. Ten volts out. Oh god's sake. Close the handle. Close the taps, the valves, the pumps. Right. Try again. Ten of those. Five of those. There we go, we've got some pressure. So now what we can do is set the build up. So it's obviously 10, 11, 12, come up 12. Mega, uh, mega Pascals, you can prevent that, bring it down, and pump it all in this tank. Because this is all insulated, it will lose very little heat. The more it smelt something, we open the inlet valve, so that's in, that's out. And this one obviously pressure goes down much, much quicker because there's pumps pumping the fluid out. The gas is out. Uh, just go remember to shut the valve. So that's that. So what do I want? I need a battery. And I need to go and find some more steel. So I think I'm going to go and do some more mining. Actually, hold on. what do I need for? To print the mod kit. Steel no need got. Yeah, I definitely need more steel, so we have to go and mine some more. How's my battery doing on this? 14% better change that. Waters 59 yeah, it's okay, oxygen. Yeah, that's all okay. Should be fine. Our jetpack's okay. So let's go and see if we can find some iron and coal.
Yeah, so as you can see, I've been mining. Uh, we've got a load of iron and coal uh, and a few other bits down here. Uh, I'm just going to hold that for the moment. What I want to do is quickly make some more steel. So make sure the outlet is closed. Open the inlet. Let the pressure and temperature build up a bit. Just want to get about one, one megapascal. And close that down. And now I can quickly start throwing the ore in and then very quickly I can make some steel. You can see how much simpler than the basic furnace this is because you're keeping the gas, you're keeping the hot gas. Um, eventually it does get cold like I say but you just throw some more volatiles and oxide in to heat it back up again. So that should be another 200 grams of steel. Oh no, we're not. Temperature's gone down. Temperature's gone down. Because I was putting steel, just open that up, it'll come back up. I think it's 800. Which point? Hmm. What's steel? Nine hundred. I was wrong. Okay. So let's close on the one. Nine hundred. K okay, one hundred megapascals. So I'd say why is my light not green? Don't know. Doesn't matter. I've got my steel. That's the main thing. Where did I need it? What did I need it for? This. Okay, I was going to vent. No, I'm not. I'm going to throw some iron through quickly. And then I'm going to blow that back into the tank. And the iron can go in there. Right, that's it guys. Uh, I think we'll leave it there for today. Thanks for watching. Uh, hit the like and subscribe button. Um, I will be making this into a more sophisticated furnace in the future. And something else that people have been asking me for. Just keep an eye on that. That's not far enough. Let's just close that off. Is how to set up the... I keep forgetting to use that vent. How to set up the air conditioning unit here. But before, before I do that, uh, we've got potatoes. This will create two potatoes. I'm going to leave it. I want to get another seed potato if I can. Push this out a couple of uh, squares, make this a bigger volume, and then I'll set up the air conditioning unit to condition this room. In the minute, it's 29 degrees. The temperature pressure is only 58 kPa. If I want to um, cool this down, I just shut that door on the outside door and turn that vent on. It'll suck air, outside air into here. Um, but yeah, hope you're enjoying it. Um, I'll see you next time. Strong fly out.